The next award is the Committee on Political Education Award, which is presented to an individual who has provided assistance and support to the labor movement in its political program. Tonight we honor the former president of ATU 69, who is now retired, and who, although he's retired, has still continued to work tirelessly as a rank and file. He has been a regular participant in our co-op operation. He is a member and has helped us to organize the Maryland DC chapter of the Alliance for Retired Americans. And he has assisted us in our get out of the boat, our labor to labor, and he has been a door knocking event as we have sought to get our message across and our political operation. Brothers and sisters, please uh, help me to honor James Allen Jr., retired ATU president of Local 689. First of all, it's a, a very, I don't know, I'm, I'm so proud to be a recipient of uh, this award. Uh, I think I have a problem. I've been in the Mike uh, Bates Energy Union for 22 years. And I'm very proud of my union, international and local. And this is the card that I carry. It's kind of torn up now. This is my union card. My problem, perhaps, is that I carry it up here. That's my problem. And that's the problem with a lot of people. But I'm sorry, I can't help I just have a few things to say because God gave me two minutes. But I think when you're a senior, you get these bricks like you do with the new union business, Josh. So anyway, uh, I just like to say that uh, even though I'm retired, I try to stay active. And that's where the young people come along. And the message I have for younger people is that don't ever let anyone disrespect you because you, you carry a union card. Don't ever let anyone. A lot of you who really deserve this with me, who I've worked with over the years, some older people like me, some of the younger people. But uh, I really accept this award of gratitude, and I really sincerely appreciate it. I realize now we have team spirit and hard work, loyalty, loyalty, that's a very important word with me, and personal sacrifice to many of my associates in the labor movement have also made this recognition possible. So I will consider this honor as one of the participation, capacities to be shared with all of those who continue to work alongside of me, and as a one mouthpiece for so many working people. Uh, I never want to forget this, and if you're ever speaking to me, you can't ever forget it. I'd like to introduce my wife, Sharon Allen, sitting with the union. Thank you again, and God bless you all, have a very happy Easter. Thank you.